What's up, everybody? It's Bad Dog here. So I'm going to do something a little bit off topic on this channel. I want to tell you about a guy that had two different mindsets and how a picture changed my life for the better. Now, you might be saying to yourself, Bad Dog, why are you putting this on your main channel? Well, because I want to drive some people to my fitness channel, which you can subscribe to down below. I'm going to leave the link in the description. Hopefully, you guys will subscribe from over there. If you have any uh, fitness goals or anything, I definitely want to give you my support, tell you everything that I've done, things that I've gone through, help you out however I can, show you what I eat, and all this other good stuff. So, hopefully, you'll subscribe to that. So, a picture changed my life. This video may be a little bit drawn out. Try to do it as quickly as I can. But I want to talk about the same guy with two different mindsets. So I had my son a few years ago. And, you know, when you have a child, it changes things. This guy over here was out of shape. I never realized how out of shape I actually was. Even though I went to the gym, my diet was terrible. I never realized how out of shape I was until I saw this picture. This guy right here was on a figurative treadmill in his life. And what I mean by that is he wasn't moving backwards, but he wasn't moving forwards. Just kind of like treading water. This guy right here was insecure. This guy right here was angry. This guy right here reacted to things, stooped to people's levels, would get combative and would insult people. Why? Because this guy was insecure and angry. So instead of focusing on himself and what he needed to do to be better, he focused on what other people thought of him and got combative and insulted people to make himself feel better about himself. That's no way to go through life. When you have a child, things change. And this guy right here realized he needed to make a change, if not for himself, if for his son. So he started watching what he ate. He started to feel better. He started to be more positive about things. He started to see results. He became more positive. And I know what you're going to say. Oh, bad dog. You get all mad when Daniel Jones throws an interception. You get mad. Yes. Guys, I get mad. I always love on the internet people like, oh, you're mad. There's nothing wrong with being mad. Being mad is a human emotion. Everybody gets mad. Everybody gets sad. Everybody's happy at some point. Everybody is, is frustrated or in love or heartbroken. We're human. It's okay to embrace your emotions. It's okay. We're human. Everybody has. Them. So, but just because you have an emotion in a moment doesn't define who you are as a person. But this guy walked around like the Daniel Jones interception every day of his life, every minute of his life, angry at life because he wasn't where he wanted to be. Well, when that guy made a change, he became this guy. This guy's way different. This guy, treading water. Happy at his job, but never went for a promotion because he just was happy where he was and didn't really think about moving forward, didn't want to make the change. This guy also had 2,000 subscribers on YouTube and was just not a very happy person inside. This guy got a promotion in his job. This guy is about a thousand subscribers away from a silver play button, which is a great time to subscribe, share the video out, and like the video. Let's get to 100,000. We're there. We're going to get there. We're going to get the silver play button. But this guy was able to do that. And why? Because he started focusing on himself. Didn't worry about what other people thought. Worried about making himself better for himself and for his family. Didn't care what anybody else thought. Because when you care what people think, you lose focus on yourself. And at the end of the day, all we can do is be the best version of ourselves that we can be. And that's it. I love going to the gym. I love the way I feel. And my mindset is much more positive than it ever was in my life. I block it out. I block out negativity. Reason being is I want to elevate people to my level. I don't want to stoop to somebody else's level. I get insulted. I get made fun of. It's okay. People want to point out your flaws because they don't want to correct their own flaws. And anybody that wants to insult you or take shots at you, it's because they're insecure about their own faults. It's their own insecurities that they're projecting onto you. And it took me a little while to realize that. So I don't waste my time with it. This guy didn't waste his time in negativity. This guy says, I'm not going to pay attention to things I don't like. I'm not going to pay attention to negative energy. This guy said, I want to worry about me and that's all I can worry about. 
This guy wanted to be the best version of himself. This guy worried about his flaws. I have flaws. Teeth ain't straight. Not straight. Big nose. Look at a beak. People say all that. Oh, you got a big nose. You, you got a big nose. You're bald. Yeah, guess what? I am bald. I am. Hey, it's part of life. Some of us lose our hair. Some of us get to keep it. But this guy right here will get ticked off. If somebody said you're bald, you got a big nose. This guy don't care. And you know why? Every human being is flawed. Every single one of us is flawed. You need to embrace your flaws because that's what makes you who you are as a person. There is nobody perfect in this world. There can be people on the internet that project themselves as perfect and they have this perfect life. But let me tell you something, behind this screen, they're not. This guy thought there was people better than him and thought he was better than other people. This guy knows that everybody's equal. And that's a fact. Some people may be more knowledgeable, may be more experienced, whatever, but that doesn't make them better than you. Some people may be more successful than you, that doesn't make them better than you. It makes them more successful than you. And what it means is they made different choices than you. We're all equal, we all just make different choices. That's really what this boils down to. You make good choices, you get good things. You make bad choices, you get bad things. This guy over here made a lot of bad choices. And when I go back and I look at this guy, this guy drives me every day to be better because I don't want to be that guy anymore. This guy loves who he turned into and knows how hard it was to make that change. Knows how hard it was to say, I got to change things. And it's the hardest thing to do is start. But once you start and you get used to it, man, it becomes easier and easier and easier. So again, man, you know, it's just a tale of two different people. Be better, man. Be the best version of yourself. And that's all we can do. It's nice to be inspired by people, but hey, you know what? <laughs> you can't be other people and other people can't be you. So their opinions of you shouldn't matter, especially on the internet. Who cares what anybody on the internet thinks about you? That is not important at all. Not important. What you think about yourself, that is the most important thing. One of my favorite things about going to the gym is not just the physical attributes, the way it makes me feel physically, but mentally, it certainly helps out a ton. I'm at ease. I put my mind in a different perspective. And again, my life got a lot better once I started making better decisions and had a much more positive outlook on things that I had to do and focused more on myself. This guy right here, that picture changed my life and it will continue to change my life. I'm not going to go back there at all. So like I said, you can subscribe to this channel. You're still going to get Giants rants and Alice, I'm a passionate fan when it comes to my teams and yes like i said i do get emotional that's okay emotions are part of being human do not uh you know <laughs> don't suppress your emotions emotions are good it's healthy it's healthy okay but again emotions do not define you unless you walk around like that every day of your life subscribe to this channel subscribe to the fitness channel it's down below like i said i'll be doing a lot more videos like this and Hey, if I could change one person's life and make them focus more on themselves and make them feel better about themselves, I feel great. I'm doing my job. That's all I got in this video. Thank you for watching. I'm out. Peace.